Hey guys, welcome to Computer Scientist channel. In this video, I am going to show you how to bring crown icon beside your name in a Discord server. Now, before we start, if you are watching this video and haven't subscribed to this channel yet, please do hit that red subscribe button so that you may not miss any valuable or informative videos. Now, let's get into the video. First question is, what is that crown stands for? Crown icon is to help server members to quickly identify who is the owner of that server. If you are a Discord user and you may have noticed that in some servers the owner of the server is not having crown icon beside his or her name. Or if you are a server owner, you may be wondering why that icon is not beside my name and how to bring it. That crown icon disappears when you don't want to take all responsibilities and you appoint staffs or moderators and when you give them the administrator permission, the crown will disappear. Let's take the example. In my server, I am going to give the owner role administrator permission. And I will save the changes and when I refresh, now you can see that the crown icon disappeared from my name. Now you can ask me that there are some boards that requires administrator permission or I want to give a role administrator permission but still I want that crown icon beside my name. Is there any way for that? The answer is yes, there is a way for that too. If you are giving any role the administrator permission but if you disable the role setting that is display role members separately from online members then the crown icon will appear again. For example, in my server I am going to give the owner role administrator permission but I am going to deny display role members separately from online members permission and when I save changes and when I refresh you can see that the crown icon appeared again beside my name. So guys that's all about the crown icon and thanks to discord for this cool feature. Don't forget to like this video, share this video and if you have any feedbacks or any suggestions you can mention it below in the comments. And thanks for watching.